Next week, Visit San Antonio will open its first overseas office. Destination? London. The staff there will court travel agencies and tour operators who could direct European visitors to the Alamo City. Success would draw millions of dollars to our region's economy, but the move might also mean better travel deals for you. Ken's Five reporter Matt Houston explains. Most of San Antonio's tourists come from elsewhere in Texas, and with good reason. But international visitors stick around longer and spend more cash. It's really just an economic question. Mark Anderson is Visit San Antonio's CEO. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're trying a new strategy. As we build ourselves into a global brand, there is no better time as we end this pandemic than to open our first office overseas. So he's hired a team in London who'll sell the Alamo City to journalists and trip planners in Europe. And in the process, Visit San Antonio also hopes to establish new relationships with airline executives. You can be rest assured we're doing our job for everyone in San Antonio to get those nonstop international flights to and from our city. Anderson says they are actively pursuing direct flights to the UK and Germany. He's coordinating with other city leaders who are quietly mounting a massive campaign to land more planes here. This is key, they say, to courting bigger businesses. So we're hoping that they open even more doors than the people that we're currently talking to. Billion dollar renovations at San Antonio International are key to this plan too, though it's not just about planes. Pre-pandemic, UK tourists spent about $40 million in our area every year. If the London strategy works out, Anderson says Visit San Antonio intends to plant offices in China and South America next. Isis. Thank you, Matt.